Hi guys, it's Miss Lisa. Is everybody having a great day today? I'm having a great day today and I'm so excited because we're on the last letter of our alphabet. Who remembers what letter we're talking about this week? It's the very last letter of the alphabet. If you said the letter Z, you are right. We get to talk about the letter Z for Zeke the Zebra. What sound does Z make? Z, right? Z. That's the sound that we make when we go to sleep, right? And the sound that zebras make when they go to sleep. Okay, so we're gonna learn a little bit um, about the letter Z and we're gonna first learn how to trace it, okay? So to trace uppercase Z, we're gonna start at the very top line. We're gonna go across and Z's kind of fun because we're gonna go down the slide. Whee! And then across the bottom and just follow your dots. Did you guys see that? Okay, let's try it again. We're gonna go across the top, down the slide, whee, and across the bottom. Did you guys try that? Okay, um, now to do lower KC, it looks just like upper KC, doesn't it? Except it doesn't start at the top, it starts at the middle. Okay, so we're gonna start at the middle line and we're gonna follow the dots again. We're gonna go across the top, down the slide again and across the bottom just like that can you guys try that across the top down the slide and across the bottom good job guys okay and then um you guys can come up here and you can trace z go down the slide and across the bottom again across the top down the slide across the bottom. So you guys can also um, practice your Z's up here with the big Z and little uppercase and lowercase Z. Um, and you can also decorate your, your zebra here and color it if you want. That's also fun. I love zebras. They are so pretty with their stripes. Okay, ours are gonna be extra pretty this week because we're also gonna put dots on them. Okay, so we have some animals here and we are going to continue to learn our sounds because um, we're gonna keep practicing our sounds and don't forget to be watching your phonics video because then we're gonna be putting our sounds together and learning some new words, right? Okay, so let's look at the first animal. That is a g, 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 gorilla. And we're gonna look at our uppercase letters today. We're gonna practice recognizing uppercase. So what does g, g, gorilla start with? If you said G, you are right for our friend Gordo the Gorilla. Good job. And then we have another friend, and by the way, these are all animals that we can see at the zoo. Good job. Then we have right next to the gorilla, Ellie the eh, eh, elephant. Eh, eh, elephant. What sound or what letter does eh, eh, elephant start with? If you said E, you are right. Eh, eh, elephant starts with E. Okay, and then I hope we remember um, what letter zebra starts with because that's the one we're kind of been talking about today, huh? What does zebra start with? What letter? Zebra. I hope everybody said Z for Zeke the zebra. Good job. Okay, another one of our friends that lives at the zoo is K. Kangaroo, k -k -k kangaroo. What does k -k kangaroo start with? If you said K, you are right. Good job. Okay, then we're gonna go down here, and another friend that we can see at the zoo is the h -h hippo. H -h -h hippo. What does h -h -h hippo start with? If you said H, you are right. Good job, guys. Okay, then our last animal is a m, m, monkey. M, m, monkey. What does monkey start with? If you said M, you are doing so awesome. Good job, guys. That was kind of fun, huh? Learning about some more zoo friends and the sounds and the letters they actually start with. Okay. So something fun I gave you guys to do today for our numbers, it looks like we're going to help finish the zebra, right? Zeke the zebra that you can actually color 
or decorate after you're done. But it's called, um, we're actually gonna be doing a dot to dot. Now when we do dot to dots and when we're counting, do we go fast or do we go slow? We're gonna go slow so we don't mess up um, um, our numbers, okay? So we can keep them in order because sometimes even Miss Lisa does. So we're gonna go slow today. Okay, so we're gonna start at the number one, then after one is two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh oh, we gotta be slow through here. Eleven, twelve, then down to thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. 19, 20. Did you guys make it all the way to 20? Good job, look. He's so happy that we helped finish him. That is so awesome. Okay, now you can decorate him. You can color in his stripes, however, or whatever color you want, since we're all talking about the rainbow of colors this week. All right, guys, I hope you had a super awesome time practicing your letter Z. Um, learning some more sounds and um, counting. And I know that I had a lot of fun and good job for exercising your brain. Sometimes it's not easy, but you guys are doing so awesome and I'm so proud of you. So keep up the great work, okay guys? And I'll talk to you later, bye.